decided to come on out to West Glacier and take a right when you get into the little village there and come down to the original entrance. There's a nice bridge. It's called Belton Bridge. And the Flathead River runs right here. And it's beautiful. Yeah, it is really beautiful. We've seen a couple of rafters come through already. Mm -hmm. And so we didn't do rafting on this trip. We're going to do that one day. <laughs> right, Kelly? Mm -hmm. They might do rafting. Yeah. Right, right, uh -oh. <laughs> she doesn't want to do it. I do, I do. Yeah, I think everybody else would. But we're going to go take some pictures down here. And it's uh, 4th of July. Beautiful weather today. A little bit overcast, which is really good for photos. Um, yeah, so we're just happy it's not raining right now because this is our last day here in Glacier. Them weather people wrong. Uh, they were wrong. You get paid to be wrong, right? Yeah. It's a good job. Yeah, I should be on there. Yeah, but well, we're gonna enjoy our last day here in Glacier. Just do a couple things. We're gonna see some fireworks tonight in Hungry Horse. I heard they put on a really, really good show, and uh, and they even shoot fireworks at people. I think. So, yeah, a little bit scary, but we'll find out what that's like. All right, what are you doing, Kelly? Photo opportunity. You sell butterflies? Oh yeah, look at them. There are quite a few. They're all over the place. They must be hatching. I don't know what we just witnessed, but it was one of the craziest things I've ever seen. Fourth of July in Hungry Horse, Montana is the place to be evidently. It's 
quite an experience. Yeah, we just got back. It's about midnight. And we were told that they just line up both sides of the road. And they did. We watched fireworks here at the campground first. That was pretty awesome. Yeah. So uh, Mountain Meadows does a really good job with theirs. They hired uh, somebody to come in. And they're pretty big fireworks. Mm -hmm. But uh, you could just hear everything in the canyon kind of back that way. Mm -hmm. And evidently... <laughs> Everybody in Hungry Horse must spend a ton of money on fireworks. They shoot fireworks for like two hours. Yeah, no. Oh. <laughs> it might be still going. It was longer than that because yeah. I think they started at nine. Maybe so. They started before it got dark. Um, <laughs> and we rode down there, what, 10.30? Almost 11. Yeah. yeah, stayed till about midnight and they were still shooting and they had bonfires and the cops were down there making their rounds and you know trying to keep the peace i guess yes so. it was interesting though um something to see so if you think that these little towns are boring they're not that's why we love coming to see different little places um throughout the year july 4th happy birthday america and uh hungry horse is a great place to be